Hi, I'm Jane Shepke, and I'm here today to talk to you about The Storied Life of A.J. Fikri by Gabrielle Zevin. A.J. Fikri is the oldest 39-year-old on Alice Island, a bookstore owner of the Hey you, get the heck out of my store variety. A.J. has spent the years since his wife's death retreating into book snobbery, alcohol, and self-loathing, and it gets worse. One day, his priceless copy of Tamerlane by Edgar Allan Poe vanishes out of its display case, and with it goes A.J.'s last living aspiration to fade away into an early retirement. Then, two-year-old Maya appears at Island Books. She's got a battered backpack, a dirty Elmo doll, and a note. The note reads, I want her to be a reader. I want her to grow up in a place with books and among people who care about those kinds of things. Faced with real responsibility for the first time since his wife's death, A.J. is forced back into the community he shunned. It's a labored process at first. Who does he know, for example, who knows how to change a diaper, who doesn't hate him? But as the process goes on, A.J. and the community start to rediscover each other. Old relationships are mended. New relationships flower, and as A.J. watches his beautiful daughter grow into a well-read young woman, he learns the true meaning of the sign hanging above his porch. No man is an island. Every book is a world. A breezy, feel-good book for people who don't normally go for breezy, feel-good books. The Story Life of A.J. Fikri celebrates the power that good literature has to bring people from all kinds of backgrounds together in a place of empathy and understanding. Funny and sad. Dry, but also mushy, and always heartwarming. The Story Life of A.J. Fikri is the ultimate book for people who love books. For more great books about books, check out our display in the library or go to www.crooklib.org.